Welcome, this is the energy vibration lesson for the Cancer Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign for the last week of July um, 2018. I want to say thank you to each and every person. Thank you for the likes, shares, and support. Um, this week is the last week, so the week begins from the 23rd until the 29th. I want to say to each and every person, thank you for being uh, so supportive. Uh, thank you for the love, the, the light that you share with us. And please remember to listen to the sun, moon, and rising sign, okay? All right. Um, for you guys, um, 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 this week is a week of uh, um, the hurt and the energy of uh, a fire sign. So there is balance for you guys. As we look at the beginning of the week, which is Monday, we have the energy of a hair sign. On Monday, we have the energy of the air sign. On Tuesday, um, we have the energy of uh, um, the Seven of Cups. Um, there's a lot of dreaming. You guys are dreaming. We have uh, the Eight of Pen, uh, the Eight of Pentacles coming up on Wednesday. So it's an Earth sign. We have Debt in Transformation. Um, that is Thursday. So that's a water sign. Um, there's a transformation that is coming in with the Knight of Wands. Whoever this person is, is an older person. Um, then we have the energy with uh, um, the King of Cups. A King of Cups, the, uh, some people have some regrets. The men over 40 and the Queen of Cups. Uh, there's also some regrets. Okay. So whatever the situation is and whatever that is playing out, we are going to be taking a look. So the magician with um, the eight, the seven of cups, what is that saying? Because there is uh, um, the two of cups, a connection. So there is a connection that is coming in. Um, some of you could be meeting someone. Some of you could be dreaming of a relationship with someone. And we are going to be seeing what is this all about. The Seven of Cups and the Eight of Pentacles. Your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true. Okay, so some of you um, was wishing and dreaming for a relationship or for a connection with um, someone of the past. And this might happen. Okay, then um, you're seeing a situation very clearly about um, a man that is... Uh, um, a um, Aries Leo or Sagittarius you're seeing a situation very clearly there's a transition that is coming in and you saw that a man had lied okay so some of you have a situation with someone um, that you have met in the past and that sort of a thing you sold that person out because someone who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius gave you false information about that person and now you're hoping that the situation can be resolved. The Queen of Cups comes in. So a lot of you ladies um, had a situation and had connected with an Aries Leo or, uh, or a Sagittarius person. This is a man over the age of 40. You had connected with this man and try to do something that was injustice. Okay. The energy of the sun is coming out for the men. Whoever you are, your wishes and dreams are coming true. Men over the age of 40, your wishes and dreams are coming true. What is this that is coming out? Claire is at the end of the week. Uh, Eight of Pentacles with the, um, for you ladies. Um, some of you ladies are going to, your financial situation is going to be balanced out. There is going to be coming a change. And uh, um, there's justice coming down on you ladies. So some of you, um, be aware because something is coming out some of you ladies over the age of 40 be aware in this week because something is going to be coming out about you okay and this situation is going to bring an end this could be an end to your work for some of you ladies over 40 um, an end could be coming out for your work whatever you have done in the past has caught up with you so you will be receiving a message at the end of uh, the week um, um, for a transition. Four of Cups is here. Some of you men have a regret. Um, you regret something that you did against someone else. And it has to do with uh, someone 
who is an um, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. You have some regrets that you have connected with this man. Whatever the reason is, you have sold out someone in the past, okay? You have sold out someone in the past to this man. Um, your wishes and dreams is coming true because this situation is coming to an end. Um, but, um, you know, uh, you need to stand your ground with this person and say, I'm not doing this anymore, okay? Some of you ladies are definitely going to lose your work. Um, um, you ladies over the age of 40, you're definitely going to lose your work. Someone who is uh, um, a Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra is going to make sure of that. Whatever you have done, they found out something that you have done, and whatever you have done is about to catch up on you. So you um, Cancerians, some of you, not all of you, over the age of 40, there is going to be something that is going to happen for the rest of the people, it is best. It's, it's a really a nice um, ending of the month because the energy of the sun comes in, which is giving you vitality, especially for the men over 40. Um, whatever you were dreaming, wishing, and open for, it's going to happen. Your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true. Some of you want to leave a situation that has to do with uh, um, an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. You want to leave the situation behind and move forward. Um, especially you ladies because um, the justice is coming up um, the justice is coming up against uh, you because whoever is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra she's gonna take you down she's gonna take you down because she's going down so she's gonna take you down with her okay um, um, some of you ladies were working with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius man um, this is not a good situation because uh, you're going to come in some real problem. I'm seeing some real problem coming up for you and you're having some regrets uh, that you have decided to work with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius man over the age of 40. Okay. The energy of the star because we're using the, um, the guiding angels and archangels to finish off this month. Energy of the star is here for the men. Um, and for the rest of the people who are younger than 40, energy of the star is here and it is a dream come true. So it's a wonderful week for um, most of the people. Um, um, Bahal from some of the ladies, not all of the ladies, some of the ladies who has to deal with a situation. Your work is going to come to an end. The Eight of Cups, your work is going to be coming to an end. Now, the Eight of Wands is here. A lot of news is going to be coming um, through. Um, there is speed. There is a lot of um, speed, a lot of news coming through. Um, uh, this news um, could be coming through to let um, some of you ladies, you know, know that what you have done and um, what you have done to someone else is going to catch up on you. Another energy of the eight energy is here. Some regrets. Um, this is the eight of cups. Some of you ladies are going to be leaving a situation behind and moving forward. You ladies that is connected to Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, you're going to decide to leave the situation behind and move forward, okay? Because it has cost you um, your job and it has cost you a lot. Knight of Michael is coming up and this is uh, someone who is uh, an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. Information is going to be coming at you. Um, this person, um, you're, you're going to need to stand your ground and back this person off you, okay? But whatever you have done, um, it's catching up on you. And it's not for all of you. It's only for some of you ladies over the age of 40 that has done something. And this is catching back up on you. Your money, your financial situation, uh, someone who is in... Um, Someone who is uh, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn is going to be helping you out, um, especially the men. The men that is connected or know someone who is uh, um, a, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn is going to be helping you out of a situation. And it could be that person that is coming back in your life that is going to help you to make your wishes and dreams come true. Okay? So... I want to say to each and every person, um, you know, get ready for the month of August because the month of August is coming in. Um, the month of August is going to be um, showing you um, new situations that is going to be affecting you uh, for the rest of the year. 
um, this is um, the end of July, so please listen to the monthly readings. Go back and listen to the monthly readings. A lot of information is in there, and it's going to help you to move forward. I want to say to each and every person, namaste. Until next time.